Dust pouring out, drilling underway. This video shows construction happening on the Bayonne Bridge. Beneath the bridge sits Leonardo's auto body. When the dust settles, this small business owner says it spells big problems. I actually had uh, uh, customers run out, employees quit between the dust and the between the dust and the noise. Perhaps the biggest blow has been the paint jobs. See this stuff on the cars? Arthur Santo Pietro says it doesn't come off. Every time you rub it, you know, you, you rub it off, even if you wash it, uh, it still sticks on to the paint. We've been trying to get it out. It just sticks on and uh, we, we, even the glue is even worse. It actually goes down to the metal, whatever epoxy is coming down. He estimates it's cost him millions of dollars. We had to repaint a lot of cars. This is one of 52 cars they say they've had to repaint. As you can see, it's still in the process of getting finished up, but these paint jobs are expensive. They estimate between seven and $12,000 per car. And on the other side of this wall, is where they're drilling. And then there's this. Inside his connected glass shop, he says the tremors from the drilling behind causes shards to shatter all over the floor. This is a $1,200 table that used to look like this. The Port Authority responded today by stating that while these claims may date back to August of last year, the Port Authority was only notified about the problems in June. And so a response is going to take some time. They just keep telling her they're processing it, they're working it, and it's just, I don't see no results. In Staten Island, I'm Christy Duffy, Pixel of News.